Om Namah Shivaya. Om Namah Shivaya. Take a deep breath into your heart. And slightly exhale. We're working on our higher lungs now. A lot of time when we meditate, we take it down deep into us, into our solar plexus, into our root, sacral. Bring it into your high lungs right now. Bring it in. Expand your high lungs as if you're trying to float on water. And then exhale. With the next breath, you're going to go a little deeper now, like follow the energy into your heart, into your lungs. Feel it at the energetic level. Breathing in. Just feel the prana as it's moving in the high lungs. Feel it as it's moving into the areoli, into the capillaries, and then exhaling. Next breath, you're just going to feel it at a pranic level. Just feel the prana, the life force. Breathing in. Let go of the lungs image. And just feel the energy, the blooming of the prana. And exhale. Next breath, you're just going to breathe it in. You're going to feel it just as a wave, a waveform, a wave of energy. Breathing in. Become attuned to that wave. Hold, just feel it kind of vibrating a little bit, or maybe it's got a motion to it. It's like a wave form. And exhale. With the next in breath, you're feeling the consciousness of the wave form that is the dolphins coming in. Breathing in. Become attuned now to the dolphin waveform energy consciousness and exhale. I'll let your breath return to normal, but you're still in the assimilation merging with the waveform, which is dolphin consciousness. Maybe you feel yourself swimming with the dolphin. Maybe you feel the tail of the dolphin. Maybe you feel your own individual higher self dolphin consciousness. Maybe you feel yourself swimming with them in a pod in the ocean. Maybe you feel the sonar of their pineal merging with your pineal gland, opening, sounding, sonar reverberating within your brain, within your skull, and out through your third eye, crown, doula, throat. Maybe you feel the your spine merging with the spine of the dolphin, tail merging with the tail bone. And just open yourself, allow for as much as you want that consciousness, that beingness that is the dolphin to swim within you, to swim within your energetic field, to align with your shushumna. Take it deep into your spine. Maybe you feel your kundalini moving up your spine. It's moving to the, up to the spine of your dolphin too. Take it up to your throat. Take it to your crown. Take it to the spout of your dolphin. Feel that conscious breathing through your crown chakra. You may even feel yourself rocking a little bit as a 
dolphins, just like you're riding the dolphin. You merge, just a merging happening, and at the same time, you're riding. And feel the exhilaration as you feel that movement as you're going through the ocean. It's a cleansing as you move through the water. There's an excitement that you can feel as you open up and feel the energy of the ocean. It's almost as if you can feel the energy of the Atlantic Ocean or the Pacific Ocean, whatever ocean you're in. It's an aliveness. You feel the organics. You feel how the dolphin feels that and knows it as part of its being. And just be with the energies. It's like energies moving up and through your spine, the Kundalini energies moving to your lower chakras. It's kind of a grounding happening, even as you're swimming and merging and riding. You may feel the energy of your dolphin as a white brilliance or a golden. abundance or crystal clarity. Breathe that into your heart now. And you'll notice as you breathe it from your lower chakras into your heart, from the tail that's moving, it's pumping the Kundalini up Do you pumping the life force up into your heart. Allow that brilliance, that clarity, crystal clarity, the golden abundance, allow it to just move into your heart. Allow it to fill the inner chambers of your heart. And as it does is you're going to notice that your inner heart is lighting up. Or maybe there's just a movement of the kundalini, the gold, the crystalline. The pearlescent consciousness of the dolphins. begin to feel as your heart is opening. Feel the surroundings of the ocean that you're in, the consciousness of the Atlantic or the Pacific, the Atlantean or the Lumerian energies, whichever are drawing you. Breathe them into your heart, tie them in with your prana. Feel the life force activating the portals within your heart, the diamonds. They're like little diamond gems sparkling and opening. You can even feel them turning within your heart. As you're swimming through the consciousness, the Atlantic Ocean, the Pacific Ocean. As you expand your awareness, you're also noticing the pod around you, the energetic pod of each of us together. And there's a sense of excitement there, there's a sense of fun, of playfulness. We get to dance in the waves of the water. We get to skim across the top of the surface and then dive deep into the peace and the nurturing of the ocean. 
we get to twirl together and helix patterns and sacred geometry patterns just to move for the fun of moving the water and feeling it against our skin. We can laugh together. Feel yourself laughing with the voice of a dolphin. Notice how that affects your brain. How it opens your throat. How your whole energetic system lights, becomes enlightened. And laugh some more. We're all swimming in a we're swimming in our pod together. We're moving about. From the outside, it may look like it's kind of random. But from within us, we feel the choreography, the dance. We're dancing. Dancing as a collective. Dancing the collective consciousness into harmony, into synchronicity. To a unified chord. Just attuned to that chord. Notice how your heart responds as you attune, how your pineal responds as you attune. You begin to breathe the liquid gold of the love of dolphin consciousness. Wherever it's moving within your heart, go there. There's an intensity, it's just an intensity. Just energy expanding. Don't attach any label or any emotion to it other than bliss. It's working its way into deeper openings within the love of your heart. Now you're breathing through your crown. You're breathing through your porthole. Breathe it down in through your crown, your activated crown, into your pineal and into your heart. Expanding your upper lungs. And just receive right now. And follow that wave deeper within your heart. See how deep you can dive into your heart, into that golden love consciousness that the dolphins are sharing with us and you're sharing with them. A 
and breathe it into their nervous system, breathe it into their blood, breathe it into their bones. And inhale it into your bones, into your lungs, into your blood. Now, each of you are a dolphin and a human. You're a merged pair. You can kind of feel your pineal gland with the sonar. You can feel the crown with the blowhole. You can feel the golden heart in your heart. And there's like a collective sonar happening. Each one of us are pulsing. It's like a pulsing energy through our third eye. And you're about to know what you're pulsing, just how it feels in your heart. See if you can attune your pulsing with the pod. There's a resonance that we can all dive into together. And unify. As a collective, now you may feel your heart expanding to your right side it's like your fourth dimensional heart energetic heart becoming present becoming golden becoming radiant just allow it to be breathed into your awareness that's it it's almost like you're breathing into both lungs you're breathing into both hearts your third dimensional on your left, your fourth dimensional on your right. As you breathe in, they both kind of become more coherent, more illuminated, more synchronized. Excellent. And your heart is fully engaged. And it's fully engaged with your upper lungs too as well. They're like a, a fullness of the breath and the prana and the life force that's moving through your lungs, through your heart, through your blood. And as you feel yourself energetically around, you notice we're in a circle, in a horizontal circle. But vertically through our Shishumna channels and through our pineal, we kind of create a 
a cone upwards, like a Shiva lingam, a, uh, not a cylinder, it's, a, it's like a Shiva lingam. That reaches up to us about three and a half to A couple different places where they merge, but we'll just say 10 feet above. Go to that point. That's a unified point. It's a group monadic consciousness. Allow your awareness to move to that unified point where we're all one. One merged. Consciousness. And now from that place above us is a unified cone above us. Go directly down down to about three and a half feet above. And all of us are going to connect to that point, our soul star collective. And allow yourself to breathe through both. If one is better than the other, then focus on that one. Monadic structure, 10 and a half feet above. Soul star, three and a half feet above. You can breathe through both and your heart. You're there. You'll notice when you get there, you'll ground. It'll like the whole energy will lighten up your spine, activate your root. You can feel the energies bolt down through your legs, your femurs, your knees, your ankles, toes. Take it to the earth grid, surface mantle. Take it even deeper down into the outer core, the inner dimensions. And take it, follow it, that tube of light, chronic tube down to the crystalline core of Mother Earth. And start to breathe from your monadic soul, heart, down into the heart of Mother Earth, into her crystalline grid. Find your diamond structure. Position yourself within the center of your diamond structure. Lock into the grid, the core, the heart, like a cell in the heart of Mother Earth. You may even feel like you're turning left and right as you kind of dial, you'll hear, dial yourself in. And then when you lock in, you almost like you illuminate even more. It's like turning in a light bulb. Allow that light bulb to move through the diamond core of your inner being, through the outer core of your chakras, your dolphin consciousness. And you're noticing also that the dolphins are in a circle. You can see like the humanity sacred structure, but there's also the morphogenetic field of the dolphin structure. And then there's the third, the merged dolphin, human, earth, morphogenetic field. That's it, open to it. And then anchor into the core again.
and allow yourself to just sit here now and just cycle through or to receive the dolphin consciousness, the human consciousness, the merged dolphin human, and the earth. As she's raising the frequency of the humanity into its position as consciousness, higher mind, Logai, for her ascension, her earth grid. And just hold that, breathe it. Swim if you feel to swim. Dance if you feel to dance. You may notice that whales are with us now. They're also in that vertical structure where their tails are facing down into Mother Earth. Their eyes are facing upwards. And few of them around us. They're like kind of creating a cylinder around our sacred geometry structure, the energetic electromagnetic field, which is a like a Shiva lingam, it's like a lingam. The dolphins are creating like a pillar of light around us. They're holding us in sovereignty and they're beginning to send their sonar into our obelisk, our Shiva Lingam, it's an obelisk. No, yeah. Oh, yeah. Allow the dolphin, the sonar outwards into the space between our oval and the pillar of light of the dolphins. And then send your pineal waveforms into that same space so that we have this merge of the dolphin whale, human, in this hyperspace conduit connected into the heart of Mother Earth. And begin to move the energy however you feel to move it, whether you move it through your body, you move it through the conduits, you move it through the grid, you move it through the oval, you move it through the pillar of light. Moving it through your breath or heartbeat. From your breath and then from your heart. You're actually picking it up, so. Begin to rotate the whole structure. Imagine the whales beginning to move counterclockwise around us. The 
dolphins moving counterclockwise to that. And the humans locking it in, grounding it, grounding it in your physicality, grounding it in the crystalline grid and grounding it in the heart. Mother Earth. And as we're moving together and grounding, we're creating an electromagnetic field. So just kind of feel that as it's interacting with the electromagnetic field or consciousness, higher mind of Mother Earth. And you'll notice that it begins to bleed into, merge into all the other morphogenetic fields of all the other animals, elephants, lions, plants, trees, redwoods. And to begin to breathe through you, through your heart. Breathe in all of the morphogenetic fields, awakening them all within your heart, the full spectrum of all the life that is Mother Earth that is within your heart. Every spectrum, every frequency, enlightened and enlivened by your love. Give your love. You may feel yourself undulating with the waves, the merging, the integration of consciousness within your own heart, ground it into your spine, move it into your root. With your next inhale, you're just bringing your awareness back up from the, your higher self at the center of Mother Earth, bring it back into your Atta Karana. Offering your pranams to the inner world, your dimensions, coming back into your waveform on the surface. Ride the kundalini up into your heart. Offer your gratitude to the whales, your gratitude to the dolphins, your gratitude to your soul star, our soul star our mother monadic goddess structure. And when you feel like you've landed back in your body, have the intention to stay open, stay in the receiving mode. Slowly opening your eyes. Aware of your physicality and yet still aware of that which you've connected to in birth today. Om Namah Shivaya.